I broke my arm. <laughs> I'm no, just calm. Just calm. I, I actually wanted to talk to you guys about something. <laughs> my x-rays because I think they're really cool. Hey you guys, welcome to this week's vlog. It is Friday, it's 10.10. I'm currently going to go over to LA. I'm going to the Department of Public Health so I can get some sort of background check for the research that I'm doing with LA County. Very exciting, so I'm heading over to do that today. And my video just went live about an hour ago for the ASMR, my summer routine. Go check that out if you haven't. You guys are really liking it so far, which is, makes me really happy because I really enjoyed making it and and um, the whole concept of it. So definitely go check that out. This week's vlog is gonna be hecka exciting because a special guest is in town. If you follow me on Instagram, you probably already know, but Gage is in town. He is in California and I get to see him, I think on Monday. I am so excited. I haven't seen him in so long. Very exciting, I'm so excited to see him, oh my God. Yeah, that is what's happening right now. It is so hot, I turned the AC off so I could film this. So I'm gonna start driving, I gotta go. Okay, bye. Okay, we've arrived. So, I guess we'll go in and see what the heck we're supposed to do. Hey guys, so, what the hell is that? All right guys, I am home now, as you can see, but I just uh, busted my finger on a rusty nail. Yikes. Hopefully I don't get tetanus. After learning about micro, I'm kind of scared now. So, I guess we're gonna have to find out. Oh no. Oh, we have ants. They come during the summer when it's really hot. Okay. That's gonna have to change right now. All right guys, so I'm currently studying. <laughs> I still have stuff that I need to get through for today so I can move forward with my day. I'm gonna try and show you more in this vlog what I eat because you guys were really fascinated by what I was making in my last video. But I had purchased this from Trader Joe's. It's really tasty. I'm having it for lunch. It's just like a quick little thing so I don't have to cook anything because that takes time. And I really wanna get through my stuff so I can kind of chill out for the day. And yeah, it's Friday. Hey guys, so it's a little bit later, it's 5.30. I've basically finished studying. Honestly, I wasn't really in the mood today to study. I did it all, but tomorrow we'll see how much actually stuck. But um, I was trying on my shorts, and now that I've been going to the gym more, my legs are getting too big for these shorts. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to DIY them so they feel a little bit looser by cutting holes in them. I don't know. <laughs> hey guys, good morning. What's up? It's Saturday. It is the 11th and um, I am wearing the same exact thing that I wore yesterday. I don't do anything, I don't go anywhere, no one sees me. It's totally fine. We're saving water by me having to do less laundry. Right now I'm just making coffee. I actually have a bad headache. I woke up with a headache, so not that fun. I'm probably dehydrated. I'm gonna get through some studying today. I think I have three hours of new content to get through. And I have the rest of the day to do whatever I want. Some of you guys have been asking where I got my laptop stand. It's from Amazon, highly recommend, must get, it helps. You guys, check this out. Look at all my fancy notes in my first aid book. So satisfying. Woohoo! So <laughs> I'm watching this cardiology video and he's like, I'm gonna play the heart sound for you. So I was like, close my eyes so I could listen to it. And it was just like, <gasps> how the heck am I ever supposed to hear this? I can't hear it. Then I realized that I was playing at 1.75 speed. That's why I couldn't hear it. So now I'm gonna slow down. This is what it sounded like originally. I was like, what in the heck? How am I ever? That's much better. 
a Rachel moment. Okay, back to this. In the modern era, we used to have to determine the severity of expenses, but years ago, for choreography, the change had used physical exam funding to determine how severe the expenses was. So we classified the severe expenses was on the slide. If the camera was late, that applied to very across the city, and it's not that. And wait a sec. I'm doing a lot of cardio stuff right now. Remember how I was having that really hard time with EKGs? I'm about to rip my freaking hair out because I don't understand EKGs. Seconds, I count one, two, three, four, five, six, six seconds, and another five beats. It's not six seconds. No, in a minute. No, okay. Only six body. So 50 times is beat. <laughs> Me, 21, 20. Then let me say we lost in it. <laughs> Why do I kind of dig it? Hey guys, what's up? It is a little bit later now, it's seven o'clock. Just been doing Anki and just kind of hanging out. I stretched a little bit because my hamstrings are really tight. So I did that and I just, um, I got ready because I'm actually gonna go hang out with KG and he's actually moving in here. You guys might know him from the vlog. He's been in it a few times. Ooh, I have to sneeze. All right, it's not gonna come out. It's like right here, I can feel it. Um. Ugh, okay. Um, I, I actually wanted to talk to you guys about something and it's been bugging me a lot lately and I figured that I would just talk about it because I'm sure that some of you guys are dealing with the same thing, but it's this whole thing about body image. I try my best to accept how my body is and I try my best to appreciate my anatomy because, you know, anatomy is beautiful. These variations are really what make you, you. And I've just been having a super hard time with accepting how my body is. There's so many almost unachievable um, body standards and beauty expectations out there. If you're going through something similar, just know that you are totally not alone and I know that my life can seem perfect at times. Regardless of whether I eat healthy and I work out every single day, I can still be unhappy with myself. It's very superficial. There are way bigger things happening in the world than my concern for my body. But um, it is just something that I think about and um, I wanted to share that with you guys in case that you're going through the same thing and um, it'll get better. You just have to work on it and work on accepting your anatomical variations. I like this spot. Oh, okay, actually, last night was nice. It was like amazing. And there were dogs there. Oh my God, there are dogs there and they're so sweet. Yes, that was fun. And then today, I'm actually dyeing my hair back to brown. Oh my God, so excited, what a good day. And I don't have new content to do, but I might because I'm probably gonna be with Gage all day tomorrow. So I probably should do some new content today so I don't have to do it tomorrow. Oh boy. All right guys, this is the before, and this is what it's gonna be like after. Wah! I'm all done. It actually looks so good. Not dry, because I was just like, oh, don't dry it, because I'm gonna um, go to the gym today. be like that, huh? These are the ingredients that you need to make the yummy kale summery salad. So we got kale here, olive oil, one mango, half a lemon for tahine, and that's basically it. So, okay, mm kale. <laughs> okay, not funny. This is also the dullest knife on the face of planet Earth. Oh my God, I almost just slipped my finger off. Take your lemon, just a little, just so the kale is kind of like wet, I guess. And finally, I'm gonna put tahini on it. That is my easy summer kale, mango, lemony salad. So good, kale's really good for you, but it's really nasty in my opinion, so this is a great way to try and incorporate it into your diet. Hi, red ants. <laughs> I'm a red ant.
Oh, give me. Oh, give me. Give me. Hey guys, so we're waiting. Oh, what's up? <laughs> Gage got nuggets because we're waiting to figure out where we're gonna eat. What are the odds? What are the odds that we get a walk in? We'll see. When did you start recording? A while ago. Okay. Well, I was wondering if I had to say that again. No, we got it. We're gonna try to work our magic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I winked. <laughs> All right, so now we're here. We have our delicious food. She got steak and chicken, and I forgot my wallet in the car, so Rachel paid for me. But I'm gonna pay. Her. I do. Miss He's not paying me back because it's not okay. What's up, y'all? What's up, everyone? So we just ate food, uh -huh. and it was very good, was it not? It was amazing. It was good. Farm. And I just took a TikTok, yeah, I and I filmed it. Because so. I'm a TikToker, I Yeah, guess. go follow him and like it. It's the one that's right here, because <laughs> I filmed it. Do you want to be in it? What's up, Rachel? Hey, hi. Hey, vlog. <laughs> hey, hey, Luke, how many is enough here? I got like 40. You guys are not gonna believe this. I'm a lobster. <sighs> like, <sighs> I've never been this sunburned in my life. What is up, guys? Hey, I'm alive. Wow, it is, I don't even know. It's not, what day is it? It's Wednesday. <laughs> I didn't vlog at all yesterday because I was so sunsick. It was awful. I like jammed through my studies yesterday and I napped. My body was so drained, my skin super sore. It's not so much burned now, but I mean my skin is pretty tender. So I also mentioned this earlier in the vlog because this just happened the other day, but LA is basically closed again, so I can't go to the gym. <laughs> my progress that I made. So that's that. I'm gonna just try and exercise because I really want to exercise and I'm really bummed that I can't go to the gym now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's it. Let's uh, go exercise, shall we? We shall. Okay, bye. already is he busy um I, I think i broke my arm <laughs> or oh, no i think i i think i ripped um i think no 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 you have boards I'm no just there. call just call just him sit there. <laughs> bye <laughs> oh my god you guys it hurts so bad. Okay. Okay. I, I, I definitely hurt my arm. Oh, it definitely hurts. Is, is it weird that I saw the anatomy of my forearm when I put my hand down? I can like be like this. I don't think it's broken. Let's go. Don't, don't worry about the lens, go. Hopefully it's not broken because I don't really want to wear a cast and I've never broken a bone. We have four minutes until we get there. What a f 
freaking journey, guys. Okay, so I'm obviously back home. <laughs> I'm in so much pain. My arm hurts a lot. So basically, let me tell you what happened. I used to be a gymnast, right? <laughs> And I was doing back bends or back bend kickovers, not a big deal, but my arm straight up snapped and I've never felt or heard anything like that in my life. So I tried to call my neighbors, um, they weren't home, so I called my two of my good friends and luckily they, they came and freaking rescued me. And then I got an x-ray and then after the x-ray I waited even longer. Um, there's a PA and she told me that my arm wasn't broken but she couldn't really say anything about any soft tissue stuff and she's like you need an MRI and then she squeezed the heck out of my arm she's like where does it hurt and I showed her I like pointed to it and like she kept squeezing down my entire arm and it hurt so freaking bad I don't really know what I'm supposed to do because there really wasn't a diagnosis it just wasn't broken which I'm happy about personally but I'm also not happy about because um, if it's like tendon ligament stuff, those take much longer to heal. It's different than bone. Bone can fix itself because it's really vascular, vascularized and all of that stuff. Uh, get through this together. I'm fine. Just in a little bit of pain. A lot of pain. At least it's not my Anki hand. It's my vlogging hand. So happy pump day. <laughs> Is it even Wednesday? I have no clue. I think it's they said it was not swollen. This, I don't know if you guys can tell, but this is 100% swollen. Um, that's really great. And then also my hands are two different colors. I don't know if you can tell. Yeah, that's uh, where we're at. <laughs> Compared to this one, right? There is totally a difference that I can't lift it higher than this. Anyways, uh, I'm gonna stop complaining because no one wants to hear me complain. There's way bigger things happening in this world than whatever is happening here. So um, I'm going to uh, finish studying. I'll talk to you guys later and let you know how I'm doing. <laughs> okay, what a day. All right, bye. This is so much harder. Okay. Yoga blocks. Boom, this is better. All right, what is up you guys? Good morning, it is Thursday, it's 8.30. I'm currently pulling up my x-rays to show you. So I'm looking at this x-ray right here. Here's my humerus, here's my radius, here's my ulna. And you guys know the ulna has like the C shape, that like lunar thing. And it has the olecranon process at the very tip. And that fits into the olecranon fossa of the humerus. It's a thin part of the bone because really that's where the you have the articulation there. And, and the ulna can, you know, rock back and forth on your elbow. So you can do this. A, a long time ago, apparently, I had busted through that process. And so I have a hole in my bone there. And you can tell because it's the the surface is really smooth and there's calcifications already um, around it which is indicating that it's an old injury um, and I've actually hurt this elbow in the past in gymnastics so that was probably what happened because I did hyperextend that elbow they didn't have health insurance basically until I started medical school so any injuries that I had I just toughed it up and I was like all right I will get through it It'll be okay. Um, everything seems to be fine. I just want to show you my x-rays because I think they're really cool. Yeah, that is my arm <laughs> in an x-ray. I think it's so fascinating because in my lifetime, I'm never going to see my arm inside. So pretty cool. But um, I'm actually going to head over to my classmate's house to study for the day. And they're going to help me out a little bit just because things <laughs> are kind of difficult for me to do with one arm today. All right, guys, it's obviously much later now. I just wanted to wrap up the vlog and thank you so much for watching. Until next time, take care of yourselves, be kind to yourselves, continue to work hard, and all that good stuff. Okay, bye. And don't hurt yourself. Okay, bye. Oh, I can't undo record. I'll make it out of one piece, or maybe two. And if I don't, it's okay, because I've got all of you.